Okay, so filling your uh, your coolant on your uh, X22GT 250. Uh, so all you would you got to do is if the handlebars are off this, you're not to pay attention to that. But if you get down underneath here, you're gonna see right there first. If you look down, you see that white thing with the black uh, cap on it. That is your overflow coolant tank. So what you want to do is you want to go right up here to your that's your, where your rat is. Um, you don't have to take your handlebars off or anything like that. Sorry, my flashlight off. But you don't have to take anything off to get to that. You can just turn your handlebars uh, left really good. Just put your hands down here. You can turn it. It's not hard to get off. And you pop it out. But to fill this, what you need is you need to have a flexible hole funnel or hose funnel, sorry. So uh, so you have to get the flex hose funnel and you can put it down in there and just pour it in tiny increments till it pours out the top. Uh, you don't want to have a whole bunch of uh, coolant laying around. You also want to be putting in 50-50 coolant. Do not put just straight on coolant in there. It's very hard on the on the water pump. It'll literally just eat the blades off the, wa the water pump. So uh, what you want to do is uh, just put 50-50 uh, coolant in there and fill it till it gets to the top and that's it. Once it's at the top, then you don't have to worry because then you have, like I said, your little overflow uh, canister is right there and it will uh, vent into that if it gets too hot. And if it needs any, when it, uh, or sorry, when it gets too hot, but if it needs any and it needs to draw some coolant, it'll draw it out of that tank.